Hello friends, I am Sayed Zishan and uh, welcome to my channel. So in this video I am going to tell you how I modified my graphic card in order to insert the USB 3.0 in the uh, PCI Excel slot. Actually I made a video on uh, how to install the USB 3.0 PCI Excel type model. But uh, actually the graphic card uh, is blocking the PCI Excel slot. That's why I made a little modification for my graphic card but uh, in that video so few or people couldn't understand how I modified so that's why I'm making a separate video on that in this video and uh, I would like to tell you one more thing guys my graphic card is Gigabyte GT730 so it is a smaller in size that's why I could able to modify that and uh, the, the length also decreased a little bit after the modification but it may not be possible with your graphic card why because you may use the GTX version they are very bulky so you cannot able to uh, modify them and uh, one more thing guys that uh, I don't have the USB, USB 3.0 card right now why because uh, after I installed that in my PC it worked uh, for uh, 3 or 4 days after that uh, it started uh, to giving the blue screen error that's why I had to return that. So here is my cabinet and uh, you will have two screws right here. You may already know how to remove this. So just take out this like that. And then here you can see the graphic card. And below this frame we have the PCA X1 slot. Actually it uh, closed the whole thing. I will show you nearly now. So here is the graphic card and this is the frame. Now you can see under the graphic card you can see this uh, small slot that is the PCI X1 slot. You have to insert the USB 3.0 card in that card, in that slot. But we don't have enough space. That's why first remove the graphic card from its place so now let's remove it so there we go we removed it this is a GT730 it's gigabyte brand it will keep it aside so here is the PCI X16 slot this is the place where we have to insert the graphic card and beneath this, this is the PCI X1 slot and uh, here you can see this graphic card we have to decrease this thickness that's why now I will show you in detail how I modified this graphic card here is the graphic card and you can see this frame, a fan actually this fan is uh, fitted to this frame and this frame is uh, fitted on this uh, aluminium fin you can see this entire aluminium fin and first take out this wire and then you can see some clipping right here you can see right now we have to take out that slowly it could break easily be careful and here you can see one more screw is there right here just take it out and now here we go we remove the fan and frame take out the screw and this is the aluminium fin we have the GPU under this so it will be at the center at this position so let me keep the side and here is the frame along with the fan actually I can take out this uh, fan from this uh, frame I will show you how 
you can see this it can be removable so now what I have done is I placed this fan onto this and then I took tags I will show you that so here is the fan and now what I am gonna do is I am not using this frame at all so I am gonna remove this and now we have to assemble this fan directly onto this aluminium fin so for that so we can stick this fan onto the aluminium fin by using any fevicol or feviquick gum but doing so will uh, permanently damage this fan why because they stick too hardly so that's why what I am gonna do is I am using these tags to tie them so I will show you how I actually done before so as you can see it has a little gap in between so I'm gonna place this below this so as you can see it fits perfectly and now just pull this completely and uh, take this side and insert into this so there we go I have tied at one side and, and also you can tie from here to here to cover this so I am doing it right now actually it's a little bit loose why because you have to tie this completely but I'm not gonna tie this why because I don't need to fit like this and take one more and uh, fit fit at here also so whatever you have alternation check with your graphic card and uh, think a little bit so you will have uh, any ideas to modify to modify that so this is how I modified in my graphic card I hope you understood how I did this so now I am gonna remove all these and fit back to it well because uh, I already said that I am not using the USB 3.0 if you don't want to use these tags you can um, use any thread silicon thread and I have enough uh, space to put this tags from inside this that's why I could able to do like this and uh, one more thing guys I would like to say that if you can't modify any if you can't modify that I suggest you to buy a PCI X1 expand expansion uh, wire so it will cost uh, nearly 150 or 200 rupees or it may be more but um, that's the easy way and but m many people are saying that they those are not so quality that's why one more thing i could suggest that is uh, buy that cable and uh, cut that wire and fold it back of the uh, motherboard so take your motherboard and that wire to a specialist and he will uh, solder it directly to that by that you can ensure a perfect uh, wire wiring connection so thank you guys thanks for watching hope you like this video if you like this video hit the like button and if you unlike this video please let me know in the comment section and if you have any more ideas leave it in the 
comment section so thank you guys thanks for watching bye bye